that chase you're about to see lasted 10 minutes, but it reached speeds of 100 miles an hour and over that. Now, in every second, you get to see the many lives that were put in harm's way. It starts off with a deputy attempting to make a traffic stop. In no time, the driver, Joseph Brown, hits the gas and takes off, blowing stop signs, lights, and nearly crashing into other drivers in Shawnee. He's weaving in and out of traffic. He gets lost for a few minutes on the dirt road and ignores the officer's demands to pull over. Pull over. Goes over in. To, uh, the other lane and goes head on with my uh, deputy running him off the road. About seven minutes in, these two make a dangerous exit. You see the smoke coming off his tires and two people jump out. There was a female that uh, jumped out second, the male first and female second, and she hit the ground and rolled. But Brown keeps going. Still southbound, two, two passengers out. When he ran and Obviously, right from the beginning, put a lot of people's lives in danger by doing that. We knew that we had to shut this guy down. With the tire blown out, he makes a dash for it, but only for a minute. You know, if they have total disregard of everybody else's safety to do something stupid like this, uh, those are dangerous people. And Brown is charged, uh, is booked on 16 charges, but the sheriff tells us he is suspected in other crimes in that county. And those two people that you saw jumping out of the car, they were not hurt and they are not being charged. Reporting live, Patty Santos, KOCO 5 News. Wow.